everyone, it's Monica from Kids Lids coming to you with Fresh Off the Hook Monday. So, this week I am unfortunately sorry recording with this awful webcam again because I tried to record a video with my regular camera and upload it but YouTube wouldn't let me. So, sorry, we have to stick with this. Alright, so this week we have my cute little leprechaun hat that I made for the community dinner. Um, little shamrocks. I didn't really have a pattern, again, of course, because I don't know how to read them, but uh, I did plain circle on top and then went to the inside loop to do this little ridge here and, uh, and then brought it in a bit, kind of like the beret, and then did it straight down, only decreasing a few each time, and then the rim is just, uh, let me see, double crochet then single, single, and then double crochet all the way around, and then keep repeating however many times you want your brim. If you want it really big, then you just keep going. Okay, so this week we have this cute little toque with the rainbow pride colors. Like I said, I'm not really sure how I feel about this yarn because of the fact that there's not much purple in it, but other than that, it's a great yarn. Um, the colors are really vibrant, and I figured that it would be great to show off the pride colors. I think so anyway. This really cute beret and it is cotton. So it has these little holes. I just tried something different this time. So adult size. Plain black toque. No decoration on it yet, but I will eventually. Another toque in variegated yarn. Um, I like it. It's cute. <laughs> One of my favorite ones. <laughs> Ladybug for a little baby. And it's really, really cute. This is a whole set. Has the toque, the infinity scarf, and the wrist warmers. So, this is the one that I made yesterday. And something completely different. A market bag, which I've never done before. So this was kind of fun. Um, and I got the pattern from All Free Crochet. I actually tried to read it. It didn't work well, as you can see. Um, I kept having to take it apart. But all in all, <laughs> it looks kind of cool. Um, so it's just double crochet. And then you skip one the whole way around. And it's one continuous you start with the top and this is cotton but it's supposed to be really long um, and maybe because I crochet too tightly I'm not sure but sorry about that and then I have to show this this is what I made this morning this is for uh, let me see everybody in my family my mother is a voteur from New Brunswick and oh I'm covering her face I'm sorry my mom is a voteur from New Brunswick, as I was saying, and the Acadian colors are, sorry, trying to get it in the camera, red, white, blue, and then on the blue is a yellow star. And then for the brim, I just put all three wools together and did the brim from OVW. Yes, you rock, Marcel. Um, and for some reason, it's supposed to be, the brim is supposed to be about this big, but mine always turns out tiny. Um, this is different, but on the um, blue and white one, you'll see that I don't know why mine isn't really wide. Like I said, I think I crochet too, way too tightly. Anyway, that is my fresh off the hook for this week. So, we need to talk about who else has fresh off the hook. So, on Sundays, it's Sugar Baby Crochet. On Mondays, it's myself and JW Originals. On Tuesdays, it's Simple Mom 33. On Wednesdays, it's D's Crochet Creations. On Thursdays, it's Baby Joe Crochet 03. On Fridays, it's One Virtuous Woman. And on Saturdays, it's Shemaine 26. Please Facebook me and um, like my page, Kids Leads. And you can check me out when I get my website going as well. All right. Everybody have a great week. Happy crocheting and God bless. Love you all. Bye.